Hey guys, so today we're gonna talk about the difference between uh, nitrogen and air inside the tire. Uh, we know that in Formula 1 uh, tires are, fi are filled with 100% pure nitrogen to boost performances and reliability. So why we should do it? Let's start with, uh, with the basic. Air is 78% nitrogen, 21% oxygen uh, and the rest is water vapor, CO2 and a small uh, concentration of noble gases but we can ignore uh, the other gases so when we pump our tires with normal compressed air we are mainly filling them with nitrogen anyway but the, the oxygen and, uh, and the water vapors are the tricky parts here oxygen molecules are small enough uh, to pass through the tire structure and this is one of the reasons why our tire uh, pressure slowly goes down for example, uh, if you measure the concentration of oxygen in a fresh inflated tire and an old one, uh, you will see that in the older one will be a smaller concentration of oxygen. Because nitrogen is less likely to migrate through the, through the rubber structure than is oxygen, means that your tire pressure will, be, uh, will remain more stable for a longer time. Filling the tires with, uh, with nitrogen removes uh, another dangerous element of air, water vapors. As the tire heats up under use, its pressure, pressure increases and the unknown water content will make this increase unpredictable. It also promotes corrosion of the steel or aluminium rim. So this would be another advantage for nitrogen, uh, the lack of water vapors. So in conclusion, uh, with nitrogen your tire pressure will remain more constant, saving uh, a small amount uh, in fuel and tire maintenance cost. There will be uh, less moisture inside your tire, meaning less corrosion on, uh, on your wheels. So I hope you understood uh, the difference between uh, nitrogen and air. Uh, drive safe and see you next time. Bye.